there we go what we're gonna do here is we're going to draw a m16 knight using autodesk inventor the one that i'm using here is uh, an autodesk inventor professional 2017 okay so here is how you start you go on new you open and then here you can see those four boxes there this is for parts when you want to create parts you can see the parts 2d and 3d so two dimensions and three dimensions so whenever you want to create your drawing you need to know what is the standards that you want to use okay here i want to use millimeters as european standards not any standard such as americans which uh, uses pitch inches sorry so now there we go so i've selected that then i'm going to create create so here i go by putting the frame polygon remember we're doing a nut which has actually eight corners so i'm gonna write the eight type in eight and then there we go there is my polygon which in this case is an octagon so then as i say it's it's an m16 that i need to draw so for m16 my diameter need to be 16 times 2 which is just two millimeters so i go on dimension then from there to the i need to have 32 millimeters so i punch in 32 millimeter then i put i press enter i need to know every time when you're using an autodesk your hands need to be on escape enter and all of all over the the keyboard so you need to know what way you need to press so then i go with my wall where the trade will be will be so then as i said it's a m16 that need to be 16 so 16 millimeter there you go so here i'm done with the frame so i need now to go in three dimensions so you can see there is just two dimensions so now i go to three mode 3d mode sorry then i press extrude you can see now so with this function this function allows me to extrude my drawing so i'm gonna extrude it by 16 millimeters okay by 16 millimeters so that will be 16 millimeters okay then i press enter as we've seen it already so after that after that i'm gonna go to trim it okay so then what i'll do to put my chamfer and everything i'll draw a circle I'll draw a circle in a manner that the circle and my lines will be collinear. So there we go. All right. So it's collinear. So that one there is collinearity and the uh, oh, oh, tangent. Okay. And that's one there you can see. So as you press, it tells you what you need to do. It tells you what it is. You can read there. So everything is given to you. So then, yeah, I go again extrude run extrude so that time what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go on more you can see this option that comes there i go on more and then i choose my degrees i choose 45 degrees the 45 degrees then i come here i'm, I'm gonna rotate it for you you can see that I come here then they check check what's gonna be happening 
If I go there, check out it looks like. If I go there, check out it looks like. Then I take intersect. There we go. So there is my nuts. There is my nuts. So now something is missing the threads. I need to put a thread on. So now for me to put a thread on, I need to. You can see it's highlights that portion, it highlights it, that portion, it highlights this portion. So then I'm gonna click in there. After that, I go on thread. There is for thread. I press it. Then I go for specification. Already, it's measured this the size already that's 16 millimeter. So for 16 millimeter, we have two millimeter pitch. So then I go apply. That's the clause. Okay. Here I have the trace standard as I saw I have everything there. So I have uh, I selected in symmetric and profile as by 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 uh, by my settings. Okay. So then I go. Okay. So there is my nut which is well done so if i want to choose the material for my nut i will go there just to make it as beautiful as i want so i'm gonna choose gold because gold is expensive so just to make it beautiful look how shiny it's gonna be yeah so there is my nut this is so beautiful so thank you for watching this video i hope you're gonna like it you're gonna enjoy it so uh please subscribe for more videos i'll be i'll be putting videos for different subjects concerning metallurgy concerning our uh, physics and uh, mechanical as well as mathematics thank you so much and please share thank you bye